Tonight, a Knoxville couple says they regret hiring a home improvement contractor last fall. They paid the man thousands of dollars in advance. He started the job, but then he quit. WAT 6 on your side consumer reporter Don Dare says the contractor they hired has been investigated before, Don. Well, that's right, Bo. The TBI, the Tennessee Bureau of Investigation, charged the contractor and his brother four years ago. It was nearly seven years ago that we started receiving complaints about the Presley brothers. Unfortunately, a couple in Halls was unaware of their contractor's history. Eleven days ago, the contractor said he would return the couple's money within a week, but he hasn't. This is the new post in the railing. He, um, he was supposed to put up, you know, finish and put the metal spindles in here. Amanda Norton showed us one part of a home improvement project that's unfinished. The work began in December, then stopped. They're supposed to take up the carpet, put new carpet down, uh, put in a new banister that will be sturdy. But the stairway is neither sturdy nor safe for her family. And all he left us with is a... a a hazard. This is the man she hired, Jonathan or John Presley. She took his picture in November when he first came to her home and wrote the contract. John Presley came out initially and he, he surveyed and then later on he brought people with him and his brother, Warren Presley. The Presley brothers, Jonathan and Warren, were charged by the TBI in 2018 for impersonating a licensed professional and not completing their work. So we agreed to 8100 with half of it as a deposit so he could buy the carpet. 50%? Yeah. Yes. You paid up front? Yes. Mm -hmm. Did he ever deliver the carpet? Nope. Amanda's husband, John, kept in contact with Jonathan Presley through text messages. He kept saying, well, we've got to wait till uh, we finish another house. Can you wait till December? And we did. And then he called like a week in December and said, Let's just wait till after Christmas. John says a few days after Christmas, Presley spent several hours tearing up the couple's staircase, never to return. A worker did return in March and stained the railings. John Norton printed several text messages between himself and Jonathan Presley. What's that? February 25th, uh, he said, I'll get with you soon. That's the last we heard from him. Tell me about your garage here. It's not done. A frustrated Barbara Croft told us seven years ago she and her husband waited over six months for the Presley brothers to finish their garage, even though they had received two-thirds of the money in advance. At the time, the Presleys operated RFG flooring. We're going to have two rows here. It was five years ago when Don Hudson helped Amy Elias, a widow, set up a closet in her house. The Presleys were hired to make home improvements. They left their work undone. At that time, the brothers had changed their company name to EPM Handyman Services. Today, Discount Flooring is the new business name given to the Nortons by Jonathan Presley. We're done with his services, and we lack our money back. Amanda and her husband sent Jonathan Presley a demand letter last month requesting their money back since he's not returned. Presley is no longer at the address listed for his business, so we called him hey, on March the 18th. Here, is this Jonathan? Uh -huh. Yes. Presley said he is now just recovering from the coronavirus. My brother almost died. We had COVID and for two months. See. Presley said he's talked with a couple and made an agreement with them. Are you going to return their money? Oh, yeah. Yeah. When? Uh, within a week. It's not their fault. It's our fault that we'll return their money full, full refund. To date, no money has been refunded, and the couple is now looking for a new contractor. Now, Presley claimed he was going to give the couple a cashier's check last Friday, March 25th. The Norton said Presley then began negotiating with them last week, saying he'll return their money over the next few weeks a little bit at a time. Again, Presley told us it was his intention to finish the job. The Norton said with the work unfinished, they may file a felony theft charge against Jonathan Presley, as some of his previous customers have done. Bo? Mm. All right, Don, thank you very much. You know, if you have a consumer question for Don, send him an email at ddare at wat.com. You can also call a six on your side hotline. The number is 865-633-5974.